up y'all and welcome back to another one. Today we're doing something a lot different. Not just a little different, but a lot. To start it off, oh yeah, we're in the old car. We got old Frederick. Hi there, buddy. What are you doing? Check this out. We got our blind, our decoys, our gun, everything you need. Right in the back of the car. What do you think, dude? Huh? Oh, is someone tired? Okay. Well, the reason why we're in the car is my truck's still in the shop. I broke the front driver's side CV axle. Completely snapped it clean off. If you follow me on TikTok, you would have seen that. Yes, your boy has a TikTok. I was weary of TikTok for a long time. I'm like, ah, it's just it's for younger people. But it's really coming around. It's actually pretty fun. Follow me there. Uh, same name, same everything. Bobby Guy Films. But today, small, small hunt. I think there's literally only going to be two of us. Me and Jordan, there were supposed to be three. But my buddy Andy, the farmer, he forgot to buy his new license. I actually bought mine online yesterday, so we're good to go. But today is a tiny, 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 tiny goose hunt. A lot of you have recommended that I do, you know, like the dozen decoy challenge, the one decoy challenge. We did do the one decoy challenge and had luck. But this time, we're going to use a handful of decoys. I'm going to use my flocked uh, Canada Silhouette decoys, a handful of them. I really don't know how many. I brought one bag, and uh, I might set out 10. I might set out 20. I don't know. The reason is, is my buddy Andy, who's supposed to go but probably isn't going to make it, found this field yesterday, and he called me. He's like, Bobby, there are 40 geese in here. Actually, there was probably about 60 or 70 geese because there was more with him at that point. He was like, and there's 10 of them on the road, literally on the side of the road that are banded. I was like, no way. I went over there and looked. Sure enough, I could spot probably two or three that were banded by that point. So, I have not shot a banded honker here at home yet. Um, it's it's going to be tough. They possibly might be roosting on the body of water that's in the field. Uh, they day loafed on it yesterday. I wasn't able to babysit the feed and um, see if they roosted on it last night. I got there at about 5.30 p.m. last night to check it and a car had pulled in the field to walk their dog. Um, yeah. So it bumped the geese, all 20 of them. It bumped them all the way to the other corner of the field. So I hope that that didn't mess them up. Uh, there's a lot of factors that this could just not even turn into a video. Uh, it could not even turn into a hunt. You know what I mean? Very, it's very possible that we won't shoot a thing, but we are in the car. Um, I got Marie today. I got Fred. We're just gonna give it a go. You know what I mean? What are you two doing up? Fred, you trying to get some loving from old Jordan, huh? I'm married, dude. Yeah, I'm married. <laughs> He's been trying to get loving all morning. Oh, you smell like butt, though. He Holy does. Cow. He stinks. He needs a bath. Yeah. On a scale from 1 to 10, what do you think the outcome, the possible, the probability that we shoot a band today? Uh, If the group comes, I'm saying about a We'll give it 15%. I say overall, even like even if they don't come, even to get them to come close enough, right? Tongers. Because the thing <laughs> is, yeah, the thing is they're roosting on the water. They are indeed on the pond. They're on the pond. Uh, you heard me talk about it earlier. I was like, I don't know if they roosted on the pond. Sure enough, they're on the pond. So we had to sneak in, no headlamps. I uh, had to walk everything in and uh, yeah, they're on the west side of the pond. So we're set up right next to the pond. So they're going to get up, they're going to see our decoys and they're either going to love them or they're going to hate them. One of the two. Um, I don't know if these birds that are roosting on the water in particular are banded. I don't know. Uh, they might be coming from somewhere else. These ones may not be banded. I don't know. This is a, uh, like, like Jordan said yesterday, low risk high reward mm -hmm. low risk maybe no reward you know what i mean it took us longer to go park the vehicles than it did to set the spread yeah how many decoys we got out 20? uh not more than two or three dozen yeah that's at it the most smallest goose hunt i've ever done yes. <laughs> how many birds you hunting? 20. yeah but real quick before we get started on this little hunt here i do have to give a huge shout out to duckswaterfowl.com for sponsoring this here video the Ducks Thermal Hoodies. I'm telling you what, the best hoodie you'll ever buy. Got them in sandstone khaki. 
and we got them in olive. If you guys want to pick one up, I will link both of these bad boys down in the description below. Oh boy. Well, we got birds. Check this out. Yeah, they're, they're definitely going to the water. Maybe we should have hunted the water, Jordan. We know for next time. Yep. So this is what's going on right here. Check it out. Landing on the water back yonder. So that's the first big group to come to the water. Look at them hammering down. Bam. So we've watched how many, probably four or six birds uh, just roost jump and land on the water. It's funny because when we were walking out here, I'm like, I have the feeling that we should have hunted the water. And sure enough, we've been watching geese spill into it. So what happens here is they roost jump early morning to the water and then they get off and they trickle into the field. The bad thing is the size of that flock. There's like three, four hundred birds in the air up there. Bad thing is, is that we're going to get one go. We're going to get to shoot one time. And when we do all them birds that are on the water behind us, and whatever's around gonna be gone vominos so uh we're gonna have to be extra extra choosy on when we do open fire here because i i have a feeling one of two things either we shoot at the next group that does it if they do if they do it yeah and hope more come take the later. guarantee though I yeah mean, that how many times have we passed up birds because like oh but there's but there's more yeah take what you can yep that's what we're gonna have to do. I don't believe we're gonna be able to land them and ba ban and ban check them. I don't think that's gonna happen. We're just gonna have to take what we can get. Oh, Freddy though, look at him. He's ripping and ready. We don't have his vest. We don't have his shot collar. I don't have all my calls. All I have is one of my old ducks goose calls. So we are running on a budget today. He's gonna go oh, he's to going to the water. He's gonna go to the water. Yep, good. Oh, good. Oh, like, oh no, he's oh, not. He's, he's coming to the field. Okay, he he's gonna be band okay. double banded and collared. We'll have to kill him. <laughs> no, he's going to the water. Okay, that's good. I bet if we had talked to him at all, he wouldn't have. So this is the issue. Just like that, it's a single, you know. Mm -hmm. And he looked like he was just gonna land right in the decoys. And we're like, okay, we have now now we have 30, 35, 40, 50 birds on the water. And uh, like I said, the first shot, it's gonna be done. Want to shoot him up top? Let's kill him. Oh God, I don't know. See any bands? <laughs> Not yet. Come on. Nope. Nope. They don't like it now. They said, "Ooh." That was a bad shot, Ooh. though. I didn't like that. They banged hard. We could have hard. killed two, but that yes. was it. Come on. Look at this. Those are big honkers. Look at this. <laughs> Those are big birds, Those dude. Those things are huge. Massive. Go to them long neck pterodactyls I've been hearing about. Oh my goodness. Do we shoot them if they do it? Oh no. We could crush. See any bands? Nope, no bands. Not that I can see. They're tucked up pretty high. Yep, they're going to the pond. Look at that. At least they're giving it a solid look at all that. They're giving it a solid look, one pass, and they're like, oh, we want to go to the water first. Shoot, you want to shoot them? Let's kill them. Oh, it's only one. Let's check him. He landed. No band on him, he's landed. Yep, he's landed. We got one on the decoy. There's one standing. Look at him. That's a little lesser. Yeah, he's a lesser. Okay, we'll just wait until Look at him, he's kind of hopping around. He's just like... Look, what do I do here? You see him? He gets close to the decoy and goes, whoa, whoa. What happened is he got behind the silo to where it was in line. All of a sudden he just disappeared and he's just like, oh. Old Fred's watching them birds. <laughs> if you guys are liking the video, I know it's a lot different. We haven't even shot yet. We're probably, I don't know, six minutes into the video or something. If you guys are liking it, smash the thumbs up button for Frederick, myself, and the old bearded man himself. This is a different hunt. Like Jordan was saying, low pressure, no pressure at all. Being really, really choosy. That lesser still in the decoys are 30 decoys. We have 30 decoys out and they're all silhouettes, Canada silhouettes. Oh God, what's happening? Um, what's <laughs> happening is there's more birds in the air above the decoys than there are decoys. <laughs> and they love it. No noise. 
Come on now. Come on now. Let's go. I have a feeling those bandit honkers are on the water. Though. Yeah, they are. Shoot them. Oh. Oh. What? I only had two shells in? That was awful. Fred, here. He did. Nice shot. Yeah. Bam. Heck yeah. Woo. Load up. Nice. What did we shoot? Me. Yeah. I mean, I shot three. Did you I shot? I, th I shot three too. One, I had to throw in another two, shell. Three, four. Fred, here. My bird. Dead bird. No band on that. These are all lessers here. Yeah, we shot all lessers. Come on, buddy. Good dog. Good dog. Sit. 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 My bird. Dead bird. Oh, Lester's. These aren't the honkers. The banded honkers, that is. But that was beautiful. We got to hurry up and get in. <laughs> yeah. If you guys like that, come on. If you haven't smashed the thumbs up button, you got to do it, baby. Woo! Look at old Frederick. Good boy. Here. Come on. In here. Come on. Let's go. Set. Good boy. Birds are loving it. This makes me want to hunt honkers a lot more. Oh, man. Small spreads. Just tiny little, mm. Yeah. Fine. Come on now. Feels better. Yeah, the water's fine. It's warm in here. Come on. Spin out and get down. Oh my goodness. Look at him. Fred's looking at him. <laughs> <laughs> you ready, buddy? Look at the ones out front. Shoot them. breaking dog good here dead bird i forgot his leash at home oh these are big birds these are the these are the ones these are the ones is we're this, looking for is this our band these are these are our bands right here oh they're big birds get in here come on just a little closer oh my goodness shoot them why am i clicking Second time, dude. Clicking. Good. Here. Well, I'm limited out. Me too. I am limited. Well, here's our honkers. Oh, boy. They are big guys. Real, real big. Checking for bands. No band on him. Fred here. Dead bird. Let's check this one out while Fred's messing around. Oh, that's crazy. Holy smokes. Are you banded, dude? No band on him either. Good boy. Here. Come on. Good dog. That bird ain't that big. Come on. Good boy. Good. No band on him either. Mine. No bands on him, dude. We got one more. One more in the water, yeah. The water. Woo! That was amazing. Woo! That was gnarly. Holy smokes. Boom, boom, boom. And then oh. I thought we had only shot four. Oh, and dude. Then, oh. We're, we're done. Yeah, we're limited. Yeah. We both shot six. our six birds, yeah, like six. right six. on the dot. Done, done, done. Something with my gun. Uh, so I, sh I fire, and then on the second one, it like ejects it. I have not, both times, I didn't shoot three times. I had to reload one. I don't know what's going on with that. I'm, I'm literally just prone for gun issues right now, but... We're limited out, boys. That's a two-man. No bands like we were hoping. Um, but still good a night. That was beautiful. Yeah, oh, wait. There, there still, still is a chance. There's one bird. This is. Uh, this was your last bird you shot, wasn't it? I'm not sure which one it was. But anyways, it's Jordan's bird on the water. Fred here. It's all the way out there. We're going to have to send Fred on it. You ready, buddy? Come on. You see that dead bird? Ready? Dead bird. Dead bird. Get him, buddy. Get him, dead bird. Dead bird. Get him, buddy. Hopefully he'll get him here. Nope, dead bird. Well, 
Fred got him. He's headed back with him now. That bird's banded. That's your bird. I'm so excited. I I hope so. <laughs> I'm, I'm so hopeful. Oh, 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 look at old Fred. He's doing great though. That was a long retrieve. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Good dog. Look at that dog. Come on, buddy. Come on. Here. It's Here. A lesser. Come on. Yeah, that's a lesser. That definitely not a honker. No band. Darn it. Oh well. <laughs> oh well. I mean, I'm gonna complain about a limit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Woo! Two man limit. Fred got to go swimming. And we're done by what time is it? 8.45. 8.45. We actually had to sit. <laughs> we actually had to sit and wait for the birds to get off. And finally, you guys seen it. They gave it up. <laughs> Honker just landed in the spread. Oh, look at these three. Sit, Fred, here. Jordan stuck out there on the dirt hill on the other side. Birds are landing in our 30 decoys. That's what we got out. Look at these three. Jordan is literally sitting on the mound. Me and Fred are right here. Look at this. That one's landing. Oh no, they're all going to land. When I say we're just sitting here, we are just sitting here. We piled everything over here by the pond, wanting to get out of here for, for this reason. We want to come back and hunt it again. So we don't want to disrupt the birds, you know what I mean? Wow, what a hunt. Are they landing again, Fred? We got some battle blood. We have five birds in the decoys. <laughs> come on, Fred. Fred, here. Don't even. Well, here's a spread. Like I said, we got 30 decoys out. Look, we got a goose in the decoy there, there, and three out there. They aren't minding us out here at all. Fred wants to go chase him, but I'm not going to let him. What are you doing, dude? This is dog, I'm telling you. Got to get him straightened out here on the braking, too. My goodness, I forgot his leash. Ooh, I'm telling you. But here we go. Look at the old Festiva. Doesn't it look good with the old honk daddies up there? Look how big, man. That's a big one. That's a giant one. He's bleeding a little bit. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Two man limit. That was pretty. Well, we are back home and it's probably about a week later and it's 6 a.m. And uh, I just got done editing this video. I still have to put in this last clip. But we pretty much already uh, talked about the hunt. I showed you the hunt. I have something else to tell y'all here. Old Frederick and I, oh yeah, we're going on a trip. And we're leaving right after I get this video uploaded for y'all. Fred and I are headed to Texas. Y'all have been requesting that Bobby does some crane hunting. Well, we're going to do some lesser hunting, some crane hunting, and some duck hunting. And if we're lucky, we might get into some pigeons as well. So, uh, it's 6, 6.30 right now. Hopefully we'll be on the road by 7.30. Headed down to Texas, down by Lubbock. So, be expecting some Texas videos headed y'all way. I'm pumped. I'm excited. I've never hunted Texas. I've always wanted to. And my buddies from Tornado Country Outfitters invited me down for a good old party. Let me tell you what, it's gonna be a good time, y'all. Old Freddy, he gets to go. Oh yeah, we're just gonna be snuggled up in a hotel, me and him. Just gonna be me and Fred. Just us two. Two buddies out on the road together. So like I said, stay tuned for those videos. I hope you guys are pumped for them just like me. But if you guys want to pick up some Ducks gear, oh yeah, I will link all these products down in the description below. Whenever you guys pick up something from Ducks, it, it does go directly to your boy and help me bring you guys more of these videos. As we all know, YouTube does not like my hunting videos. They keep getting demonetized. So your guys' help goes a long ways. But thank you all for being here. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that notification bell down there because it will notify you when your boy uploads. <sighs> but like always, I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for being here here allowing me to make you guys these videos i love it but until next time peace.